Hey everyone and welcome to the channel. So in this video I wanted to talk about my GTX 1050 Ti and my AMD FX 6300 both overclocked uh, update and as far as uh, liquid metal goes I had some lying around so I went ahead and applied some to the uh, graphics card and um, just for fun I was playing around and put some on the IHS of the um, uh, AMD FX uh, chip. I really don't suggest doing this because it doesn't really affect the temperatures that much. It's better if it's delated, but unfortunately, these particular chips in this uh, time or in that time when it was made, uh, you couldn't really delid them. So, anyways, uh, I went ahead and just wasted some paste or wasted some liquid metal, if you will. And, uh, anyways. I went ahead and removed it later because it wasn't worth it and I went ahead and put some MX4 uh, thermal paste. Uh, that seemed to work quite well. So I just wanted to see what temps I was going to get. I know the motherboard and everything's all dirty and dusty and all that but after I took everything apart of course uh, everything got a good clean and I wanted to see what uh, I got out of this. You know, what is it worth uh, you know the $400, $300 and something that I paid uh, in today's uh, you know uh, titles as far as 2018 goes all right let's go ahead and get to the benchmarks
Okay, there you have it. Five games tested. Uh, if you like what you see, don't forget to toss me a like and subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon to keep me posted with the uh, updated uh, you know, videos coming out. Also, if you want to see more about the GTX 1050 Ti Overclocked, head over to the channel and check out the video. Also, I can put uh, videos in the tabs on the side there so you can go ahead and click those. And uh, thanks.